right, so I need to figure out where to put my computer so I can edit some videos. Kids are making forts, taking all the junk, bringing it in the backyard. Isaac's just sitting there shaking his head like, what the heck? Yeah, if you hear that in the background, you can hear it in every video. That's our youngest daughter, Haley. She just likes to make noise. But I need to build something maybe bushcraft style for my computer desk. Let's go outside and look. And Talia here, we're gonna go find something to make a computer desk with because I'm not about to go out and spend any money on something when we have all this free stuff called trees and stumps and good stuff like that. So let's go find something. Okay, so I've been eyeballing this nice pine stump for since I've been out here. I don't know, maybe I can use that for some sort of desk for the computer? I don't know. Alright, we got this jet sled, they call it here. The snow's kind of melted, but I think this will help us pull this up in one piece without having to drive my truck back here. Manual labor, good stuff. Let's go get it. I don't know if the wife's gonna like this big hunk of wood in the house, but I think it'll look cool. We'll see. All right. So here we go. I think we can make this work. An old pine stump. Pretty neat looking. A little bit of dirt stuff behind it that I'll have to clean out. Clean out this hole a little bit. Clean out some more, but. That may work. All right, so we need to clean out some of the dirt out of the cracks before I bring it in because the cleaner it is, the, less, or the better of a chance I'll have when the wife sees me dragging in a big old hunk of piece of wood. All right, we got on the sled in one piece, clean a lot of the dirt off, a lot of that old dirty stuff from the inside out. It's almost like cleaning out and cutting a deer, but I kind of want to leave a little bit of this mossy stuff on there. All right, pull it up to the house. I got the hard job here holding this heavy camera. See, these girls are gonna be tough. We got one pulling, we got the other one supervising. You got my tail back there? Don't break my tail off. <laughs> oh. Have to go up, down. Boy, it's a lot bigger in here. Okay, thanks. I wonder if I can mount that. Here, somehow, and put the computer either back there. Let's chop that off.
back here has all the power outlets that will be going back here to the plug and it could all be hidden behind this so it'll look all natural besides the pretty lights I guess who knows I guess you get bored out here in the woods so you do some weird stuff but it might look cool it might look dumb but I'm gonna do it and see what it looks like when it's all done so now like I said I gotta cut out that from there straight up and just cut out this chunk so this bad boy can slide in there between the wall and this okay this will work maybe All right, bunch of hammering and chipping, making a big mess later. We got clearance back there. It's not touching the computer. It's against the wall. It don't have to be bolted or anything to the wall because it's top heavy and it's wanting to fall out toward the wall. It takes a lot of force to pull it this way. So it'll be fine. So hopefully once I get it plugged in, all hooked up, I gotta figure out how to mount the keyboard yet. But like I said, perfect back there. Be pretty cool. Whew. Boy, if I would have brought my chainsaw in here and just cut that off, it would have been a lot faster, but you know, chainsaw in the house is probably Get me in more trouble than this. Alright. I clean up this mess a little bit and then figure out how to get the uh, keyboard mounted. <laughs>
so I ran into a little snag otherwise it's looking good keyboards mounted nice and solid looks like it's floating on a piece of the wood but I need something for my mouse All right here so I'm gonna have to go find me something more interesting I guess I have a different child to help me out this time Autumn is here Talia is taking a break because she had to drag that whole desk and she's wore out and that was 10 hours ago all right so in our little stump area we're pulling stumps out i found this little gem right here let's see she's kind of twisty and neat looking so we may Maybe be able to use this. I have to clean it up a little bit and see what's rotted and what's not. But all right, Autumn had an idea and found this little mushroom thing that grows on the side of a tree. She busted off. We'll see about putting that on there. We we'll got a third leg. Yep. We'll use that to help balance this piece. <laughs> the saw and we're gonna go cut the mouse pad out of another stump root root whatever they whatever the kids are calling it these days so back here to our same stump pile roots whatever we're gonna cut a section out of here for our mouse pad it's actually a pretty cool little piece too so yeah, we'll cut a piece out there so it all looks the same and get on with it. Wow. 
Wow, that's quite the hole. Pretty rotten. It's not too bad. What? All right, well, it's a little rotten in there, but this might be enough surface to use. It might look neat. It might not. We'll uh, we'll go check it out. All right, so here's what we have. We come to the conclusion that it looks pretty cool. Like this on that, so it's on the three points. And I guess it has character or something like that. What do you think, Autumn? She likes it. Good job. Good job, Autumn. And Talia, wherever she is. Good job, Haley. I only heard you sing in the background a couple times. Uh. But you're pretty good. Little Haley. Haley, you look at that. Yeah, you gotta look at the lens. Say, hi, I'm Haley and I'm a rock star. Hmm? Look at, straight in there and say, hi, I'm Haley. And I'm a rock star. Hi, I'm Haley, and if you're watching this video, I'm a rock star. Comment down below if you love my singing. Here it is. Check it out. What? So the green shines through.
Well guys, thanks for watching 9 to 5 to Life Off Grid. We hope that we can inspire you to go rip a stump out of your backyard and build something cool with it too. If you like our channel, please give us a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed yet, please do so. It really helps us out. Y'all have a great day. Thanks for watching.